In this video, we are going to debug a sample Maven based web application in Tomcat server using IntelliJ IDEA Community Edition. As we can see over here, I have a standard web application project which is Maven based and it has certain Java classes, Java servlets classes to be very specific. And inside the web application folder, we have the standard directory structure. I have few pages in HTML and I'm going to debug this particular web application within Tomcat using Smart Tomcat plugin. Let me go to File, Settings and under the plugins, you can see there are various plugins. Let me type Tomcat. As you can see over here, this Smart Tomcat plugin is appearing. I have already installed it. In case you have not installed it, you can come to this place. If you get the Smart Tomcat over here, there would be one install button. You need to click that. The installation will take place and then you need to restart the ID once. So let me go back and I have this sample web application over here and I want to create a configuration so that I can debug this web application in Tomcat. Let me click Add Configuration. Now under this Run Debug Configurations, let me click this plus icon to add new configuration. Here we have this Smart Tomcat. Let me click on this. Now we need to add the existing Tomcat server so that this particular plugin can work. And here I'm going to provide the Tomcat directory that I have within my system. In my case, I have the Tomcat 7 version at this particular location. I'm selecting the root directory of this Apache Tomcat 7 and clicking on OK. So as you can see over here, it has identified the Tomcat server. Let me provide a name. And one important thing we need to mention over here is a deployment directory. So this would be the web app directory of the particular web project. So here within this particular project, I'm going to select this web app directory. We are set here for the debugging purpose. Let me click on apply and OK. Now let me try to debug this particular web application in Tomcat. I'm clicking this debug icon over here. Now the Tomcat has started booting. The server is up and you can see the icon of this particular web application is shown. Now we need to place a breakpoint so that the debug can take place. I'm going to this login servlet. This is a simple class which does uh, some validation for user ID and password just for the sake of displaying the debug action. Let me place a breakpoint over here at line number 22. And I'm going to open this particular URL in the browser. This is the very first page. I'm clicking on the login and adding some value over here. Click Submit. Now, ideally, this is where this Java class is hit. And as you can see over here, the breakpoint is hit and we can debug the class according to our need. I have provided the user ID as admin and you can see this value is admin and also the password I provided as admin. So all these values are appearing in the variable section, meaning the debug process is working. So in this way, using the community edition of IntelliJ IDEA, 
we can debug any web project within the Tomcat server.